my husband and I would like to open a cookie store. We've done all the research, and I'm very confident we can turn a profit. I've brought some samples if you'd like to try one. She said one. Take one. Mm, well, these are delicious. Let me just run this by my supervisor. Yes! We're going to be a great team, like Moses and his buddy who like to collect seashells. Yay! Hey, dude, can you pass me a speck of spaz? Sorry, bro, all out. You want a cube of fruish? No, I'm not into fruish. I got to tear a laser dragon. Can I handle that? I don't know. Can you? Gum, what the hell is going on? Up next on Nickelodeon, uncomfortably hot 18-year-old girls. Honey, where are you off to? To the car wash to raise money for our new soccer uniforms. Okay, have fun. Nickelodeon, casually ask your daughter what that girl's name is, then take your laptop into the bathroom. Okay, time for some recent history. This is the 1990s. This is the entire 1990s? Yes. Mom! Dad! Meg is doing foot porn! What? Oh my god! Peter, our little girl is doing pornography! We gotta stop her! What the hell? There's an animated version of you and me doing it. Who put that on there? I don't know. Why don't you ask all these letters to Santa Claus? Something's going on. We haven't gotten mail in a week. I, I haven't gotten mail in a week. Nobody writes you. All right, guys, let's pay the check and get out of here. Happy birthday to you. You guys. Happy birthday to you. Happy birthday, dear Peter. Happy birthday to you. Aren't you going to blow out your candles, Peter? Mom, I think something's wrong with Dad. Peter? Peter? Oh, my God. Help! Someone call 911! It's okay, ma'am. This happens here at Bennigan's all the time. How long does this last? Hard to say. It's best to just move on. Well, look at us. You know, we make a great team, guys. Like Huey Lewis and the Jews. You don't need money. I'm sorry, the bed's breaking up. It's just that Brian's been so distant lately, and, and we used to be inseparable, like Jack and Jill. Well, so then Jack takes these two pails of water and trips and totally falls down the hill. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. Hey, I got a funny story. Jill had a tooth fall out, and she swallowed it, and then we had to root through her feces to find it. And we did. And then we took it to the dentist, and he put it back in her mouth. So I guess we're both klutzes, huh? Why don't you spin another tail, crap tooth? No? My turn again? Okay. Jill's barren. We used to be so close, but now we seem so different. Like a whale and his developmentally disabled brother. Oh. Hi, guys! Oh. Get in my mouth, you hundreds of fish! <laughs> Peter, I'm your conscience, Jiminy Cricket. Ah, bug! Andrea, you set a place for Jiminy again. Oh, so I did. Why? Why did he have to go around telling strangers what to do? Wasn't being a pediatric oncologist enough for him? <laughs> he hit on me at your wedding. I'll be as irresistible to her as wood is to a woodchuck. Mom, Dad, I've done a lot of thinking, and I've decided I don't want to go into the family business. I want to be a doctor. Hmm, let's try that on for size. How much disease could a woodchuck doctor cure if a woodchuck doctor could cure disease? Is that sounding right to you? No. Hey, Jimmy? Yeah, Dad? Next time, if you have an idea, run it through the test before you embarrass yourself. <laughs>